Hello everyone. So with the release of the Kronos style, I made a poll on my community tab about what your thoughts about this style are. And a lot of you guys seem to think that it is overpowered. Well, I actually think it is very fair. And I guess slightly weak for my playstyle as well. Part of the reason why this is the case, is because the Kronos style actually does have a lot, and I mean a lot of downsides, and I will be naming every single one of them in this video. Because the game does not actually tell you its downsides. Let's first talk about the downsides of the Kronos style on its base form. Kronos has below average stats on every single stat. Yes, you heard that right. Every. Single. Stat. Kronos has below average damage, which you can see almost clearly if you use Kronos a lot. Sometimes the attacks you deal only deal a pixel of anti-heal damage. This style also has below average stamina, slightly less than average block damage, a very weak block. And the biggest downside of them all, below average health. Think of it as the same disadvantage freedom has. And that's not everything about this style's downsides. So far, a lot of you guys tend to think that the reason why it's overpowered is because of its focus mode. But in reality this mode is such a risky move to use. And this mode is very easily countered. For one, the focus mode on high skill matches will probably only be used twice or thrice. Because the conditions needed to charge up this meter is very hard to accomplish. The only way you can charge it up consistently is by feinting so you can land counter hits. But feints tend to be very unreliable and can be easily avoided by just dashing backwards. Sometimes feints don't even lead to counter hits at all. And will just let you land normal M1 strings. Leading to you not being able to charge up your focus ability. So your best source of charging it up will have to be emoting mid game. And if your opponent plays aggressive, you will never be able to emote. Now for what's bad about focus mode as a whole, this mode is insanely broken in the damage department. But would you believe me if this mode does also have a lot of downsides too. This mode gets completely shut down by a single hit. Which makes it a hard mode to use, while also being very risky to use. On top of that, you cannot block during focus. You also take extra counter damage during this mode, kinda like hands low and shotgun. And the icing on the cake, both your M1s and M2s during this mode has almost zero anti-heal. So if you deal a crap ton of damage during focus mode, the opponent can simply hit you once to stop your focus and heal all that health back. Granted, if they run away, it gives you the opportunity to charge up your focus by emoting. If that was too much for you to intake, here is a full list of its downsides. Big shout out to Spectral who is a tester for the game for this information. I am making this video to inform everyone who really wants to use Kronos about its downsides so that they can effectively learn to use it to the fullest while also informing everyone who has a hard time against it on its weakness so they can exploit them. And judging from the disadvantages, you can probably already tell that in order to beat Kronos, you must let them lose focus. By simply throwing out feints, dodging their attacks if they are on focus mode, and also make them unable to charge up focus meter, by periodically being in their faces so they can not emote, while also watching out for M1 so they can not land counters. Hopefully this video helped some of you guys who wants more info about Kronos' downsides, and for you guys who has trouble against Kronos as well. Oh yeah, this video is secretly a tier list video. And judging from what I said from yesterday's video and this video, I would definitely put it at around mid A tier, the payoff on the focus mode is huge, but I do not really think it makes up for the sheer amounts of disadvantages this style has. Where would you rate Kronos on the tier list? Feel free to comment down your thoughts below. Anyways, that's all from me. See you guys on the next one. Peace.